There is little argument that Chesapeake is one of the most enviable companies to work for in Oklahoma City. And one of those jobs is that of a geoscientist. And within the Department of Geoscience is a job called a geosteerer. And one of those geosteers is Lane Slater. Today she takes us around the Chesapeake campus to show us what her job of steering four natural gas drills in the Haynesville shale play entails. So we drill down. Um, it's about two miles until you hit the Haynesville shale. I love my job. <laughs> this is pretty much the, for me, this is the absolute perfect job because it's a way to do science and also um, you're producing something. There's something tangible that's coming out of this and that's, you know, that we're drilling these wells and we're, you know, getting natural gas out of it. I absolutely love it because um, I, you know, I love science and I love geology, but I was always looking for a way to kind of be able to communicate that to people, and this is the perfect way to do it. And so they've drawn a line on here and showed exactly where that well bore is going to be. I have a lot of different responsibilities, but the main thing that's always going on in the background um, is that I'm responsible for four different rigs. So there are four rigs just spread out um, over the Haynesville Shale, and they're all drilling wells and they're in different life cycles of that well. So I'm not necessarily always doing this part of the well. Um, you know, it takes a couple days to drill down and then it takes, you know, a certain amount of time to drill out also and just setting up the rig and spudding the well, which is just, you know, before you drill the well, that takes a lot of time too. So, um, but that's basically what I do for the most part is I'm a geo steer. You have to know the rock properties that you're going through because, you know, we're not necessarily drilling through shale all the way. I mean, we're not. We're drilling through all different types of rock and then we use the 3D or 2D seismic depending on what we have available in the area. We use our visualization room to share information and concepts between geo That's Chesapeake geophysicist geo Bob Schmicker. Not only is he a science genius, but he's also an expert at super high-tech 3D imaging. Up there, you're seeing a piece of a 3D seismic cube and the basically the rock formations uh, mapped as horizons on the 3D data. Bob's 3D imaging room assists Lane in two objectives, finding opportunities and avoiding problems. This is unconventional drilling that we're doing, um, and we are specifically going for shale, and shale is a sedimentary rock, basically formed of mud that has dried and solidified. Um, in order to get the gas flowing through there, you have to have um, porosity and permeability. So we just go in and artificially create that permeability. Boring through the earth to find natural gas is all in a day's work for geo steerer Lane Slater. It's a living as a presentation of the journal record. You can find this story and the rest of the day's state business news at journalrecord.com.